anyways once again it's car chronicle time and um, today we're gonna talk about um, a little test that my pastor had us take this Sunday so um, basically this test was um, very interesting and stuff so I'm gonna put the little test um, right here and um, if you want to do it for yourself also you can do it you know you can go ahead and do it yourself and um, just annul the answers that I put because I'm you know I don't have a fresh copy of it so just annul the answers that I put and then do it yourself so basically um, our pastor was talking about how um, we have four like basically four traits which are dominant um, independent I think it was you'll see it when I show you the paper independent um, the S was for steady and C was for compliant so um basically everybody has four of those traits in them and um some people have a greater percentage of it and some people have a less percentage of it and it turns out that i had uh mainly s and c which was a steady and compliant so i'm basically i'm steady i'm used to doing everything you know a certain way and you know that's how i like to do it i like stuff to be steady i don't like you know just any random stuff going out there and uh, and then after that um, compliant you know I listen to whatever you know someone has given me instructions and stuff like that so you know I like to listen to people and you know the instructions that they gave me and I listen to their instructions you know my parents I listen to them you know my pastor I listen to him um, my husband I listen to him too and I just been like that you know I'm a very respectful person if you say something I'll do it you know and if it's right you know of course I'm gonna do it if it's wrong I'm not I'm not gonna do it because <laughs> I'm not about to be you know if somebody tells me to kill this person of course I'm not gonna do that you know that's 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 not part of complying <laughs> complying is just being obedient to something that you know you agree with and um my husband when he took the test he got the i and i think it was he got i and s i think i and s and um i feel like he's very outgoing and that's that's basically what the i meant you know a very outgoing person and he um he's very uh influential i think the i was actually influential i just messed up <laughs> So I'm, you know, I'm gonna have it for y'all, so y'all know what the I is and all the other stuff. So um, he is very influential, and he will go up to anybody and talk to them, you know, speak to them, and you know, he'll make you feel like, you know, he's known you for years. So um, he's very open to people. I'm more, you know, a little bit more back, you know, but I feel like. Um, with this test I realized that you know it's actually good that I got married to my husband you know because I feel like if we would have never got married you know um, I probably would still been somewhat of an introvert person because he's more of an extrovert person um, he likes to go up to people and talk to them and I'm more like you know hold up and you know new ideas I'm not up to new ideas you know I'll be like nah I'll wait and he's more open to new ideas, you know, going ahead and working through it. And I feel like um, he's done, he has pushed me to do a lot of stuff that, you know, um, I wouldn't regularly do, which is a very good thing. You know, you always want somebody that's going to, you know, push you to do greater things. And I feel like uh, we actually balance each other out in our marriage. He's more the, you know, extrovert, and I'm more the introvert. So that helps out our marriage, you know, a good amount. So um, he pushes me. Like, for example, uh, with his YouTube channel, he kind of pushed me to um, be more into it. Because before, yeah, I've been, I've been doing videos for five years, but I haven't been consistent with it until um, last year. And that was just recently. <laughs> Last year, I think it was like in June or August. I don't know. It was somewhere at the end of the year where I started, you know, being more 
more consistent you know posting a video after video after video so um yeah he's done he has pushed me to you know um you know do more videos and stuff like that and he also helps me um you know focus on it and um he's actually um very proud that i'm doing it and stuff and i feel like you know it's it's good to find somebody that's not this not exactly the same like you because i feel like if i would have got married to somebody that was the same exact as me i feel like we wouldn't be able to push each other the way that me and my husband push each other um yeah we'll probably still be good together it's just that um there wouldn't be much of a, a of a you know more push towards to doing stuff so um yeah so this test really uh made me realize that you know he's very like that and um when the pastor got to explaining you know what the i stand and everything and he got to talking about how when he first met my husband you know um carrie was just going up to people and shaking their hand and just talking to them and stuff and he, he was like um you know the first time he came to the church you know to visit the first time the very very first time he just would go out to people and just shake their hand and the pastor was very shocked by that and I was like yeah Carrie's like that I was laughing the whole time because you know that's how he is and I just you know follow behind him which kind of helps me to also talk to other people so um yeah that's all for today I will put the um I'll put the little test right here and you know you go ahead and look at it and then do it for yourself too and um basically what you do is um you just circle bubble in, circle whatever's you know good for you and then at the end you just tally it up um i think on the side of each little square and then each square um the first one is d then the second one is i and then the sec uh, the third one is s and then the last one is c so um once you add them up at each section you'll see which one you're more of and then you figure out you know who you are <laughs> as a person and I will also put the present percentages of other people in general as an average of what they are you know what all of us are and what is more the percentage of us as you know human beings and yep that's it all right y'all have a nice night day or whenever you watch this and also you know go ahead and like and subscribe to my channel and you know keep watching my videos so bye